One of the plans being bruited by Wynne and her madman environment minister, Glenn Murray, and here's the news. It's a requirement that Ontario families buy electric vehicles. Those expensive, unreliable, small, short-range, show-off-y things that are unpopular for a reason. No family buys an electric car. You can't fit a family into them. No working man buys an electric car. They have short range, no, no, no truck, nothing reliable. Can you imagine making an ambulance or a fire truck or a police car out of an electric car? Of course not. Nothing important would be so unreliable or expensive or impractical. But according to Glenn Murray, they're considering forcing Ontarians to buy 1.7 million electric cars in the next seven and a half years. Now, just for comparison, the entire United States of America, which includes California, the crazy part, the entire USA only buys about 100,000 electric cars a year. And again, many of those are show-offy cars paid for by government agencies just to show off. So Ontario, which is 1 20th the size of the states, is now going to be commanded to buy more cars than the states every year. That's how you get to 1.7 million. Oh, that sounds reasonable, doesn't it? And you know, nothing says reduce, reuse, recycle like an old Prius with that massive battery. How do you get rid of that? Good luck of disposing of that battery in an eco-friendly way. There's so many stupid ideas crammed in this plan. Thanks for watching. Click here to never miss a Rebel update. Want even more of the Rebel? Well, click here to become a premium member.